Bindula Masikane, let me check in with you at Vets University where it seems to have gained momentum last week uh, around the demands of the students. The university overnight sending a communique basically saying that they will continue with learning and teaching uh, online. Um, but also we've seen reports that suggest that actually accessing the Vets University campus uh, particularly for the protesting students, has become something that's a near impossibility. What are you seeing right now? Yes, Tulas, uh, you know, we are outside of the Vitz University campus here in Brampton, where we do know that uh, the academic program is continuing online uh, following that statement. But we did know that uh, from the Vitz SRC that uh, they were planning to continue with their protest action Today, um, of course, announcing a national uh, shutdown over this weekend. And while we are seeing some campuses uh, that have uh, already begun their protest demonstrations, here at WITS that has not been the case. I can tell you right now that I've been here since uh, the early hours of this morning and we're yet to see uh, any of the uh, protesting students begin their demonstrations. So what we understood uh, from some of the communications I've had with SRC members and students was that they were going to gather inside uh, campus grounds at the Matrix, which is a, a food court um, here inside uh, the university, and then they were going to come out after about half past nine this morning uh, to start their demonstration. Till right now, to us, that has not happened. And what I'm understanding from some of the communication I'm, I'm getting from students um, and those inside is that it does seem as though they are not able to gather the numbers uh, that, are, uh, that are needed to start their demonstrations. And one of the issues that's uh, affecting, affecting this is that we are starting to see divisions among the students along political lines, especially here at Vitz University. There seems to be a fight for um, the glory, or should I say the power, um, of saying that they began the protest, they're the ones leading the protest, and it's now starting to show along political lines. So students are not uniting um, on, the, on, the, on the causes that they've brought to the table, but now are being divided uh, merely by which political party they are affiliated to. All right, Slindela, we'll come back to you in just a moment. Let me check in with 